Australia captain Steve Smith struck a magnificent double century and Mitchell Marsh a huge hundred of his own to demoralise England on the third day of the third Ashes Test in Perth. Smith who made 141, not out in his side's first test win in Brisbane batted throughout the day, moving from his overnight 92 to an unbeaten 229, his highest test score. Marsh, on his return to the side, compiled his maiden test ton on his home ground, and was 181, not out at the close. England managed only one wicket all day their attack wholehearted, but lacking the tools to be incisive on a flat pitch and under scorching sunshine. It was chanceless and ruthless from the skipper, who moved his batting average to 62. As on the second day, the offside scoring was a feature of Smith's players he became the first captain for 24 years to score a double hundred in an Ashes test. His celebrations on reaching 200 were animated, and, by the close, he had 416 runs in the series at an average of 208. Marsh had played 21 previous tests and averaged only 21 with the bat before being recalled to replace the out-of-form Peter Hanscombe and give Australia an all-round option. He entered after brother Sean edged the off-spin of Mo Ennerly to slip with the hosts still 155 behind and the second new ball looming.
It was a day that further highlighted the limitations of their attack. Though Anderson and Broad have more than 900 test wickets between them, England do not have the pace or quality spin to make openings when the conditions are hot and flat. In eight consecutive away tests here and in India the lowest first innings total England have conceded is 328. On every other occasion the opposition have gone past 400. The tourists went through numerous plans. Over and round the wicket, sometimes with as many as six men on the legs. I. I. F. Anything, they did not spend enough time settled on a traditional line and length. There was no lack of effort, though. Overton even bowled with a hairline crack of the rib, suffered when he was hit, while batting in the second test, and aggravated when diving on Friday. Until the test match finishes, we have to believe you can get something out of it. Now we need to show we have got character, we have got guts. Mitchell Marsh speaking to ABC about his maiden century. It's taken me 22 tests. I wasn't really nervous. I felt calm, and that kept me going. I wasn't thinking about too much. Anything wide, I was just going to slash it. Quote, you aspire to do that every game you play for Australia. It means a lot for me to make a 100 in front of my grandparents. They've watched every game in the past eight years. It's reward for all the hard work. I'm ecstatic. I'm a bit lost at the moment. I'll be having a cold beer tonight. Quote, former England captain Michael Vaughan. Australia were ruthless today. You can achieve ruthlessness when you face an attack you're not fearful of and can't take you out of your bubble. It's nothing we should be surprised by. This has happened too consistently in Australia in the 21st century.